Hello guys. Hope you all are doing good. I'm back with a new video. In this video, we will be running some uh, benchmark softwares on this Lenovo IdeaPad Gaming 3. And with this benchmark softwares, we will be getting the detail of CPU, GPU and RAM speed and disk speed. So quickly, let's start with it. So firstly, I will be showing you the details of this laptop in the about section. You can see the details over the screen. It's IdeaPad Gaming 3 with the i5 10th generation and 8 GB of RAM and 256 GB of SSD and 1 TB hard disk. It is powered with the 4 gigs of Nvidia GTX 1650. Now I have another important point to discuss as people DM'd me saying that they are not getting the actual battery backup. Now I would recommend you to go on the uh, battery icon. and check over the battery details and check the manufacture date of the battery if your battery manufacture date is 8 or 9 months older then there is a chance of getting an issue with the battery drain in my case it's just 2 month older now let's begin with the benchmark test using no bench software i will be mentioning the link in the description to download this no bench software now let's quickly start the test When you start the test, it will utilize 100% of your CPU and 100% of your GPU and gives the result. Then it will test the RAM and storage disk by running at the maximum speed. To get the best result, I will just uh, put my settings on the performance mode. Here in the GPU test, uh, you can see the sample uh, frame rate of uh, gaming. It's around 120 to 130 frames per second. It's quite good and impressive. And here we are done with the test, and we can see the CPU score that is 1010, which is quite impressive because the company uh, like Cinebench claims around 963. it's quite impressive and ram speed is around 13 183 which is really good and gpu score is really extremely better than 816 and disk speed is 175 which is quite impressive this test gives a different score when you are you have plugged a charger to your laptop and when you have unplugged it so if you are testing it on your laptop do test it with the, both the scenarios in my case it is giving a very negligible performance score that's pretty fine now we will be testing with the sina bench r20 software now let's start the cpu test by unchecking the cpu single core with this software you will get an idea how 4k video how fast the 4k video is rendered and how uh, fast the photoshop works in this laptop In the description I will be mentioning the link to download this software as well. While using this software your CPU clock goes to its maximum. In my case it's going up to 4.18. And I'm not speeding this video so that uh, you can get an idea how fast your the 4K videos are rendered on this laptop. However while it's rendering we can talk about the availability of the this laptop. Uh, this laptop is available at sixty four thousand five hundred on Flipkart. It's the best deal right now. However, the sales are going on. You can go and purchase it. I will be mentioning the link in the description. And here we are done with the test, and the score is like two hundred and thirty one. And Cinebench R twenty claims that it scores around one thousand nine hundred and sixty. That's all for this video, guys. Hope you are, you all have enjoyed this video. If any queries, comment below. I will be answering all the questions. Thank you.